Hello there, YouTube. Totally links is here. And I just wanted to talk about how liberty is making headlines every single day now. Uh, libertarians have been running as Republicans quite often lately, since the whole Ron Paul thing. His son, Rand Paul, is definitely one of the new Republicans, I call him. And they're definitely starting to change the party more over toward a constitutionalist, not so much as a uh, let's make all the dough we can party. And uh, in there is Ted Cruz, uh, even Marco Rubio, you know, all fighting for our rights up there in Washington. Uh, you, if you haven't seen Ted Cruz's uh, little spat with Dianne Feinstein yet in the committee the other day, it was the most hilarious thing. If I can find it, I'll put a link in the description below. Uh, actually, I found... Uh, his reaction to what happened and it has that in it so I'll put that down in the description below but let me know what you think about this new Republican Party that that is uh, becoming to unveil itself it seems like it's definitely uh, grasping on some good constitutional issues the drone thing uh, the assault weapons ban immigration uh, you know they got their roots everywhere and they are sponsoring and co-sponsoring all kinds of bills right now um, Marco Rubio has the immigration bill, uh, you know, obviously Rand Paul has a bunch of, of, uh, Fourth and Fifth Amendment bills, Ted Cruz is getting deep into the gun control debate, and, uh, it's really good stuff. All of them are definitely making a, uh, good step forward for the country, and hopefully it makes some sort of impact. So make sure that when you're voting for somebody... You look into their morals, and you look into what they they really stand for, and you look into their background, and make an informed decision when you vote. And definitely do write letters to your congressman and let them know that you appreciate them either fighting for you, or that you're going to definitely make sure that they never see the light of day, like I am with Senator Bill Nelson. I will put so much money and so much backing and so many videos into campaigning against him the next time he's up for election. I do not like my Senator Bill Nelson. He's the one Democratic senator from here in Florida, and he's a piece of trash. He couldn't even say, I hate you. He couldn't write me anything. Whenever I've written him over a 100 letters, probably almost a 1,000 now. So, uh, Bill Nelson, you suck. Don't worry. I'm going to make sure you're voted out. Tiddly Winks is signing off.